This was supposed to be a time of joy, but instead of celebrating a wedding, this family prepared for a funeral. Michelle was married only three days ago, her wedding henna still on her hands. She, her 27-year-old groom Zahid Ali, and some guests were on board a boat for a reception in the central city of Multan. But the boat capsized and the groom drowned along with 16 others. Officials said the crowded boat was crossing the Swan River Chinab in central Punjab, one of the worst flood-hit areas in Pakistan. The bride said she survived by grabbing an electricity pole. My parents told my in-laws to wait until the floodwaters had gone down. Don't go, they said. But my husband's family said, everyone's going on the boats. Let's go. That's why we left. The bodies of the victims, including that of the groom, Zahid Ali, were taken to a Multan hospital ahead of their burial. The family had been warned about the dangerously high waters, but officials said they went ahead anyway. The floodwaters in the Multan area were at their height at the weekend, with the Pakistani army dropping much-needed relief supplies. More than 300 people have died in Pakistan in the floods so far. And with the water now moving to the southern Sindh province, authorities are watching closely to see if they'll have another crisis on their hands. Shaima Khalil, BBC News, Islamabad.